Well, hello and thank you for tuning in. I'm Joel Tucker at Virinx RV Center in Grand Rapids, Michigan. And I want to show you today the brand new floor plan by Keystone RV. It's the 2019 Hideout 318 LHS. Now this is a double slide bunk house with a gorgeous bunk room that will sleep up to five children or adults in it. So stick tight, we'll do a walk around on the inside and outside, show you all the great features this offers. So stay tuned. So let's start on the outside of this Keystone hideout at the key feature here, which is your large outdoor camp kitchen. So we do have a nice oversized door, which is actually thick, and it has these gas struts and a nice cover if it decides to rain while you're out camping, right? Cool thing here, you do get a large refrigerator for all those beverages. You have your plumbed sink to wash your hands if you get a little dirty. Storage above, some nice countertop space, and then your two burner cooktop. So you can cook up some burgers, some pasta dishes, some fish. You got the ability to do so right outside here. Um, as we move further down, you'll see this is a two door coach. So you have a door right to the, the bathroom and a door to the main area. Right above us is gonna be your large power on LED lights. It has the dump feature and it also has a pitch feature as well that we can have water run off. As we move down this way, we do have hookup for our television, outlet and a slot here for a mountain as well if you do want to have a tv outside you can do so pretty easily on the front it has a nice pass through storage a power tongue jack all things you will need on any great camper well welcome inside your brand new keystone hideout 318 lhs this is about a 35 foot camper weighs about 7600 pounds so if you have a half ton truck full-size suv you can pull this and again, this is a bunkhouse, so it'll sleep up to 10 people or so. Um, you got your living room, your space up front in the bedroom, you got your sofa, dinette, and then five spots in the, in the bunk room for you to sleep on. Right now, we'll touch on a couple things, starting in the kitchen area, um, and then kind of go from there. So we have your 6.3 cubic foot Dometic refrigerator that works both propane and electricity. So enough space in these for camping trips that last up to a week or so. We have your high point stainless steel microwave, your vent fan with light, and then a cool feature they added this year on the Hideout brand will be your Furion flush mount cooktop with oven. So you got these cool blue lights, you got a flip up backsplash, and this will work super easily to cook up some pasta. You got plenty of space right here in the countertop space and they did change the look to make it a little lighter and brighter inside. So I do like the look here and they extended it out a little bit further for more prep space. Enough room with a, for a Keurig, crock pot in the corner there. You got plugs throughout, nice setup there. A double bowl sink. Um, a lot of people are going to the, singless, the single bowl sink these days, but this is nice to easier to wash your dishes. We have lighted cabinets up top here with a glass insert. Um, we do have storage down below with your drawers down here for your silverware and whatnot. And one cool thing, which you might have just seen right below here, is going to be your central vacuum system. Not a lot of brands out there will have the central vacuum. Um, you can leave your broom at home and it's with a ho hoses attachment, so you can clean up the camper pretty easily. So let's look at your big slide right here as well. Uh, a pop, uh, opposite side of your kitchen area will be this ginormous slide with a booth dinette and your sofa. Now this does drop down to be a bed for extra guests and it is a good size, comfortable area here for you to sit down with friends, family, pl play games, eat your meals, very nice setup here. We do have these nice decorative lighting up top here, a little added touch um, this year in the hideout with your pleated shades. And again, your nice gorgeous hard balances throughout. Your sofa right over here will be a jackknife sofa with an armrest that flips down. And it doubles as, again, a sleeping area. Look how easy that was to operate. Put it back up and you can see down below you have storage beneath here for extra blankets or linens. Uh, from here, we'll talk, take a walk back to the back um, bathroom and bunk room. So follow me. Well, let's head on into your bathroom, which is very spacious, enough room in there for you to change your clothes in. You do notice you have a porcelain foot flush toilet, 
and a nice storage cubby, cubby hole right there on the back wall. You do have a window for your oversized entry door, a tub and shower combination with shower surround and a vent fan up top. You have a nice size uh, sink and vanity with storage beneath that and your mess and cabinet with a mirror as well. So very spacious bathroom in this Keystone hideout. All right, let's check out the bunk room. But before we head back this far, right here in the hallway will be your pantry. So you have three deep wide shelves and then a fourth one down below here, which is not covered by the door. Um, great area for all your food items for sure. But come on down in, in the bunk room, which does again have your sliding door. Now this is a brand new floor pan this year, so it gives you the option to have up to five folks back here. You have an oversized bunk over here. We have a little bunk over here with a window right behind me. And underneath this will be storage as well. It's all empty back here. So this will be a great spot to put extra blankets or your luggage. Very nice right there. And then again, we have more storage space over here, a spot for a television. This opens up for items down below, which is very deep and wide. And then we have a spot on this here to hang clothes and store clothes. And then in the second slide, which will have your other bunk, and I do like this because it does flip up here. You can lock it in place. And then the kids can sit down here. If you have a television up here, sit back, watch a movie or two, play a video game. And then also, if you have extra guests, this will act as another sleeping area. As easy as flipping these bad boys out and you are good to rest up. In the very front of this Keystone Hide, it will be an entertainment center wall here with extra storage above and below. A nice spot for a television. And then your, this is gonna be your entertainment center. This is Jensen, Bluetooth radio, DVD player, CD player, and AM FM radio. Uh, the front bedroom has two entrances on both sides with these nice accordion doors for your privacy. As we head on in there, you'll see it has his and her wardrobes, a shelf, lights, windows on both sides for extra ventilation. And then it has plugs on both sides of the bed for your cell phone, charging, um, alarm clocks, things like that. So this is a camper queen with storage beneath it as well. A cool thing on the far side over here, as I make, make my way around, you do have a nice cool feature, which is gonna be your laundry chute. With this tab here, open it up, and you can actually put down beneath here a laundry basket and throw your clothes down there to keep the, your camper looking nice and clean. Now, wasn't that fun? A nice walk around on this Keystone Hideo brand new floor plan, the 318 LHS by Keystone RV. Now, I know you love it, so give me a call at any time at 616-965-9623. We take trades, we finance, and we ship right to your door. So take care and give me a call. Let it